Chipmunk of Power presents What to Give a Writer for Their Birthday. Birthdays are great, aren't they? Yay, congrats on being alive! Go you! Let's have some cake. Of course, it's best when the birthday is your own. Yes, aging, but also adulation. But an awful lot of the time it is not. Odd how that works out. The problem with it being someone else's birthday is the fact that you have to get them a present. Otherwise, you don't get cake. Okay, you probably still get cake. But it'll taste like guilt. Guilt cake. And nobody wants that. But you might be saying presents for regular people are tricky enough. What if you have to get a present for a writer? Writers are so writerish. Never fear. Here's a quick list of easy ideas for the writer type person in your life. Notebooks! It's a classic. You basically can't go wrong with this one. One notebook? Fine. Two notebooks? Yeah, better. An entire house filled with notebooks? Now you're getting the idea. Will they ever use them? You really don't understand writers, do you? Pretty, pretty pens and pencils. Sure, these will end up either unused, broken, or lost, and the writer will have to work on their magnum opus huddled in the corner by the fire on a cold winter's night, scrawling illegibly on the back of a shovel, or else maybe just use a computer. But again, this is not the point. Sheesh, weren't you listening? Flash drives. For the writer who insists on the very latest in technology. Okay, to be honest, these may go unused as well, as the giftee will save everything to the cloud or their hard drive, or completely forget to back up at all, and it's only a matter of time before they lose months of work during the next computer update. Who says the life of a writer is boring? Headphones or earbuds. The writer may or may not listen to music while writing, but these will help ensure they are not disturbed. If earbuds cannot be obtained, a blanket or a paper sack may do the trick. An exotic villa in Spain or other location. Well, we can dream, can't we? I mean, it's kind of our job. Time. We're not asking for much, just a reordering of quantum physics and our perception of reality. What, like that's hard? A multi-million dollar publishing deal. Nah, you know what? Never mind. We'll make this one happen all on our own. Any day now. Well, that's it for this go-round, because it's not like we writers are a demanding sort. In fact, if you like this video, all I ask is to give us the old thumbs up and comment. What's the best writer gift you've ever gotten? Or the worst? Definitely subscribe if you're not already for more writing love every Thursday. And click the bell icon to receive regular updates. I'll see you next week, and until then, write with power!